Drip, but it kind of looks like a character you'll see in like some random RPG mobile game. But it still has a pretty cool design though. Diamond Khan's leadership is constantly under question and the law of the strongest prevails. In this environment, a new barbarian superstar has risen, called Drakebite. He made his name by slaying dragons in the Northlands. He wears the skin of his victims as a cloak, which confers him protection and extra powers. For stats, power 11,066, life 142,959, speed 8,206. Overall, he's got a decent power stat. Rank 0, Cold Blood plus Season 2, Fugitive Hater, which is good. Rank 1, Bleed Hater, which is okay. Rank 3, Tough, which is okay. Rank 4, SC Self Random Elemental Hater, which is okay. And Rank 5, SC Self Precision, which is average. Overall, he's got a good trait. His decent route slots for sawing armor so he can do more damage and sustain himself. Drake Bite has an average move pool, like Guard Down, Bleed, Damage Boost, Torch Removal, and has access to a zero quarter and zero stamina move. The moves that I would use would be Spinning Cloak, deals moderate dark damage to one enemy, removes all torches from itself. Second move, Deep Wounds, deals moderate dark damage to all enemies, applies bleed to all enemies. Third move, Bloody Hell, deals very heavy dark damage to one enemy, applies damage boost to itself, and bleed to one enemy. And this final move, Hit It More, deals heavy dark damage to one enemy, applies guard down to one enemy, and damage boost to itself. Overall, Drake Bite is just an okay attack with decent power, good trait and decent route slots. The good thing about him is that his move pool is good for bounty hunt, he has low cooldowns and stamina costs on his moves, and he has a spareable zero cooldown and zero stamina move. The bad thing about him is that he has an average move pool, only one form of torture, and random haters can be RNG sometimes. 